We are live. I feel like I need to do that because of the mustache. <laughs> what up, ninjas? It's your boy, now Town Ninja oh, AJ. We're trying to do that with smoke in your mouth. We in this bed. Don't, don't go. Don't do it. We're smoking your mouth. A lesson from Boom! The motherfucking ninja. The luchador. That was last night. Last night I was Boom! Great. The ninja. Boom! Boom! It's that Boom! The door with that bitch. Exclamation boom. marks, motherfucker. Boom! The ninja. All calm like. Today I'm you can still be Buddha, be, you can still be be the a Buddha ninja from from Lucha, the luchador from I'm, El Salvador. I'm be the lucha. This is be from lucha El Salvador from Guam. 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 That's where he claims from, but like he ain't really from the streets. <laughs> he ain't really from the Guam streets. You don't he, know. He's set tripping. You don't know. He's me. fucking set tripping right now, motherfuckers. How you go? Set All right. Set. I'm so from, check it out. This episode Eastside. is landmark Wait, shit. I said this, Eastside. Er, <laughs> er, the claw. The claw. Er. All right. So it's a landmark event. Holy shit. It couldn't have worked out any better. We, You would think that we planned this shit like this, which we technically really didn't. We, we, I mean, we did plan it, I mean, we but did, we didn't we did, plan we it. We yeah. had no idea until like last week. Yeah, we didn't know what day we were going to do this. This is episode... Oh, that's nine. Ten. Two hands. Two of them. Unless you're missing fingers, then and there's you'd some be like this and shit. Just eight. Eight and a half. Just verbally say it. Don't use your finger. If yeah, you got, if you're missing fingers and you're trying to count past the number of fingers you have, just verbally say it. So what is it? It also just happens to the tenth episode falls on. I mean, it's just, it, so today's some kind of like special day or something. Yeah, it's your kid's birthday. Yeah. Oh, my bad, I, forget. I didn't forget. Uh, I forgot. Uh, what else is that? Would not what else me. is my? Other than that, it feels like it's something like, like everybody like knows. I, don't know. Know. I can't. I can't quite put my finger uh, on it. This is what day is it? Hold on, it's October thirty first. No, no, the rent's not due yet. Not till tomorrow. Uh, yeah, I'll say it ain't till. Well, you know, a couple days after, but you get the gist. What the fuck is it? Oh yeah. What? Happy Halloween, motherfucker! Motherfucker, I'm gonna get some candy, motherfucker. I'm gonna take all your motherfucking kids outside because I'm coming for them. I'm gonna be like, bitch, give me your candy right now, motherfucker. He's been talking about it for months. He's coming out the bushes and he wants the candy. Dude, I swear to God, my shit looks like a child molester. We candy jack, dude. There's unicorns and like you got little incentives to bring your ass in here just so I can punch you in your motherfucking head and take your candy. And go ahead. We carjack. Go ahead, all you fucking cardigan sweater wearing stepdads. I'll fucking smack the shit out of you too. I don't give a fuck, man. And steal your girl and smack her ass. What? And your Freddy glove, bitch. What? Damn. We ain't got one. Cause we ain't got. I got the what? sweater. I got the sweater. He got half the costume. I'm he ain't even. I ain't even got the. He got the bird or nothing. And he, he got. got what the fuck? Look at this guy. Torch with Look at this beautiful face. I got a torch so if he got the Freddy Krueger one, do you got the Michael Jackson one? You know, just beat it. Oh, thriller. I'm, what are you talking about? No, I'm just talking shit. Me. We can't forget about oh, fucking no. the tripod back there fucking oh, rocking no. with us. Yo, 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 yo. Right now. Oh, no. That's purely speculation, y'all. It is purely <laughs> speculation. Which means he could be lying to us. Yeah, he could be lying. He could just be like, man, I'm tired today. <laughs> yeah. Me, on the other hand, I've been snorting cocaine and fucking hookers all night. Since so 3 a.m. I'm like, I've just been awake. He called me at like 4.30 and shit was like, bro. Ask him if you wanted some cocaine and some hookers. You want some blow? And I was like, damn, bro. I'm about to go to sleep. He said, hey, dude, I got four hookers over here and still got another eight ball. Like, and the sun's getting ready to come up. So. All right. So, a bunch of crazy ass shit has happened over the last fucking since we did the podcast. Which, if y'all haven't seen episode nine of the What Up Ninja podcast. Crazy. That shit is up it's right now. Right now. Right fucking now. Right now. It's I'm fucking, telling you. It's insane. The shit that happened, I can't even fucking tell you because it's rated. Like, we had to go get a parental advisory. <laughs> for mature. Yeah, dude. Like, it was fucking like, insane. 
I, normally lawyers, we don't do this. The law offices of What Up Ninja came in here. And I know they were like this with all the fucking different lawsuits and shit. and shit. It was like, damn. They came in and was like, bro, I don't think you should put this podcast out. Like, listen here, man. Like, you, this is you've gonna offended be practically everybody but the people that laughed in this room. <laughs> I was like, God damn. And I don't normally look like, y'all know that this is some important real shit to us, because we don't talk about last week's podcast, other than telling you to check it out, right? Right. This man, last week, was, if you never seen none of the podcasts, and you stumbled on the Halloween episode, because it got, like, mixed up in your feed with Halloween videos and shit. Whatever. Watch episode nine. Like, a- after ten. We don't even know... Like half the shit. I haven't even went back and that. watched it myself, but a little bit right before a little we started bit. shooting. A little right, and dude, I'm. Still, it's. <laughs> I may or may not have jerked somebody off. <laughs> shit. Speculation. Shit, no, shit gets crazy. Speculation. Shit gets it's, crazy. That it, may it goes may beyond speculation when you get it on camera. I'm still shitty, dude. I used a lot of cocoa butter in that video. <laughs> yeah, dude, that was a lot of cocoa butter. It was a lot. I knew. Yeah, I was list. looking at the bottle. I'm, I'm ashamed to know y'all and how dirty y'all got that day. No, I'm just. <laughs> 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 Me as a Christian. <laughs> Me as a Christian, that shit was nasty. No, <laughs> that shit was nasty. So, the craziest <laughs> episode yet of the What Up Ninja podcast. Uh, watch that shit. Fucking don't sue us. I mean, there's a warning on that bitch. Yes. If you have a weak stomach. Yeah. Or if you don't like the fucking F word, you really please don't please read through and agree to all terms and conditions before. <laughs> and click the, the box. Away. Click the box, yeah, please. Click the box at the bottom. I agree. Well, subscribe. <laughs> yeah, it's, 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 that's what it is. And if you hit click the, the box that says subscribe, it, it means you agree with the terms and conditions. Oh my gosh, man. So anyway, so as you see, we got fucking paparazzi <clears throat> today. Yeah, yeah, we did. Shooting pictures of us and shit. Only Quit a few. aiming like that, Todd. You know so what? That's, you ever thought that just goes to show you, Todd like, is like a fucked up word. Todd. It sounds weird, right? I don't, I don't like Toby. I feel that. I don't I'm like glad, the Toby. I'm glad. Is that because of roots? Huh? <laughs> Damn, you had to take it there. I had to take it there. Damn, that Who was deep, guys. Toby. I know a few people named Toby. Like yeah, how many named Toby? Like fucking HR from the office. No one likes that guy. Is it because his name is Toby? Probably. Is that because of the roots? <laughs> I mean, there has to be a deep side, deep, a deep reason here that nobody likes the fucking name Toby. But Todd, I always thought Todd sounds like turd or something. And it's just like... <laughs> Todd sounds like Todd and turd mm-hmm. sounds like turd. I, I was never a Ralph fan. Yeah, man. We were supposed to do the whole episode with our hands. We forgot. Well, now we got it. That's how it gets it. What do we? What do we? What do man. y'all want us to do with our hands? Man, um, uh, hold on. Whoa, I take that whoa. back. I take right. that back. Okay. We're gonna get some fucking. I already comments. opt out. Let's talk about some shit this week. You can never opt out after last week, like of anything. Look, okay. <laughs> Look, no subject is sober. Down. Brandon's not responsible <laughs> for drunk Brandon at any point in time ever. Okay. The, the that's just taboo law. On the state law, baby. Podcast. I'm just saying that right now. Huh? Speaking of the state podcast, law, baby. Yeah. My face is like. <laughs> there is nothing. Loose. Absolutely. Absolutely. Nothing I can do when the alcohol hits my system, dude. I just turn into a fucking freak, dude. And like, I do things and shit happens. Oh, and you wake up the next day, and you know what? You can't think about the past, man. You gotta move forward. There's reasons for that. <laughs> Okay, you don't want to remember the past if you've seen some of the shit that I've done. So lots of crazy ass shit has happened. I got a demon in me. Some new music has happened. Matter of fact, I want to talk this right now. Right now. I seen a post, a post. last night. Preach it. That shook the motherfucking. Oh my god. The, it, whole, the whole city. I was shook. It, I was shook. like, remember, remember when I called you? It was like, bro, are you shaking? I'm telling you, I was, was shook. Like, I was shook, dude. I told him, I was, I was like, shaking. bro, I swear to God, I feel like mob deep in this bitch, dude. Like, I'm shook. I, all right, so the homie Mitty posted. Oh, shit. About trying to get our homie 
and Nate the Tripod's homie. And my he, homie. You know that motherfucker, right? You remember that dude, right? Yes, I remember. You remember that dude, Nate the Ninja? You remember yeah, that? I remember. Yeah. He was pretty cool. You, you, yeah, that motherfucker. Yeah, I remember because you was mad because he, he had your name. Man, and I was pissed. And you were like, fuck that. I seen yeah, him at the. I, 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 he was like, I've been doing it longer. Remember we gave yeah, him yeah, shit. I seen. We like, but technically he's old. I seen him at that show that one time, and I swear he was trying to, like, intimidate the fuck out of me. Like, dude, he was it's just, like, nonstop mean mugging the fuck out of me, dude. I almost wanted to smack him right across his mouth, but you know how that like, is. Like, I'm mean, bitch! So what happened? All right, so he posted about having this motherfucker, our homie Nathan Ninja, and motherfucking, uh, who did he say on that? Oh, shit, here we go. Oh, shit, I believe the almighty spit. The almighty spit. One of the, the best, track. one of the greatest. So many... Which, I don't know if you've even met many, actually. I have. Have you? I think so. I was okay. at that show, right? The second one? No, you weren't at the second one. With the he, same name as He me. was at the second Nasty Bash, right? Yes. He wasn't yeah. at the first one? No, I was not. Then I've met this dude somewhere. Emerson, maybe? Probably. Probably. Uh, yeah. Maybe. But anyway, that's beside the point. Many posted about getting a track laid down with fucking our homie Nathan Ninja and motherfucking Almighty Spit. Well, then that shit kind of like rolled. And it got you started oh, picking shit, up. I'm sorry. Hey, I gotta forgive myself right now. I am not bored. I've been up all night doing cocaine and hookers. And I'm just uh, Which part has you more tired of cocaine and hookers? Man, I'm telling you, dude, probably the like the hookers, I could go another round right now, really, if you want to be honest. Well, here, let's do this. Are you paying? Come on, man. Huh? Are you paying? What, for the hookers? Yeah. No, dude, I put Come that on, shit on the company spot, credit card. Man. Hell yeah, dude, that well, right on. Do this line, but they can't see us because of the Thank you to the law offices of What a Ninja. That was all purely speculation. Purely speculation. All right. Woo! Yeah, now we're back. Woo! All right, bro. So, as he mentioned that, it was already like, damn, that's a devastating collab. You know what I'm saying? The almighty spit, Nathan Ninja, and motherfucking Mitty. Holy shit. Well, then that shit started, like, rolling downhill. And it started picking up momentum. And it was just snatching artists up. Fucking next thing I know... The homie crafted pops on the motherfucker. Yep. And he's like, bro, let's make it an even doper collab. And motherfucker's like, yeah. And then all of a sudden, the motherfucker we just spoke on, motherfucking nasty, he pops on this bitch like, shit, this is going to be the dopest track ever. <laughs> <laughs> and like, so now all I can do, all we can do is wait for the fucking devastation. That's going to be fucking... Sweet with these Naptown streets That's and shit. That's gonna be tight. That's gonna be a dope ass fucking song, and I'm hyped as fuck for that shit. That's gonna be tight. Now, ironically, there's been a lot going on in the music world, man. We just haven't been able to talk Devil's about it. Devil's Night. The Devil's Night game. mixtape. Uh, Nasty was talking about that shit when he came on the podcast, and he was. And ironically, I wanted to drop the podcast on Devil's Night. Last night, but we were busy. But we're going to we go sweet yeah, on we're, we're gonna talk. We're gonna but we was busy night. last night, so it didn't get uploaded last night. So it did not get uploaded on Devil's Night. But if you have not checked out this year's Devil's Night mixtape, we got motherfucking the who's I mean, so who's I don't know who's wrong. I want to smoke out of. Hit them both at the same time. Well, they're Let's both Bob Marley. Here, look. Here, dude, put some weed in that, and you can have your own. No, 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 hold on. I want to see you hit a bunch of time. I can't, dude. It ain't going to work. And totally this shit ain't even got no weed in it. Put some uh, weed in it. We got to take... Hold on. No. No, hold on. We're going to keep talking while we're doing it. Keep telling the story then. What was the story was I telling? Fuck. I'm high. I wish so. Do y'all remember? Tell us in the comments. God damn it. <laughs> 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 That's... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Devil's Night. We're back now. The Devil's Night mixtape. If you ain't heard that shit yet, Nate, fucking check that shit out. Yeah, about 10 minutes. Let me see. Oh, okay. I thought you said one minute a minute ago. No, you got about five minutes at this okay. point. Cool. Oh, shit. We're still yeah, rocking. Then we're going to go into... While he's doing that, I'm going to tell you, on this music break, we're going into the last song at NAP because we got so fucked we're up gonna last play week too, that we didn't get to play it. We're going to play a couple songs. Yeah, but. no, I'm sorry. We are. But while we're on NAP, 
Uh, we'll play that last song, and then we'll also play that one that we really like. But yeah, dude, we fucking Devil's Night. We were supposed to make some shit happen, but we did some shit, and some shit happened, and some shit shake and bake. Some shit happened the day before that, too. Yeah, and some shit happened the day after that, too. Devil's Night morning. Whew. Y'all ain't even ready for that shit. But we'll speak on that in a little bit. Uh, so much that happened. Wrestling, there's so much wrestling. to talk about in the wrestling. There's so some... make sure that you watch this whole shit. Because there's don't all kinds the of shit. Don't watch the opening and be like, I got all the news I need. That's why I don't tell them what we're going to talk about. Yeah, but then if they don't know what we're going to talk about, then, then they, they have to watch it all the time. Yeah, but they don't. I know, they're... but motherfuckers, <laughs> you better fucking watch, watch this shit. God damn it. For you ain't even got to really watch you. it. because like, 619 you. Our visuals not necessarily you know, fucking. All you, gotta do, all you got to fucking do is listen. Listen. Or Put that shit on at work. You ain't doing nothing. Might as well laugh with us. I got I got a plan. You know what I do? I play them in my sleep at night. I hit play and go <laughs> to bed. It it? No, nah, back here. No, nah, I just hit play and go to bed so that way we get a full view. That's how I do it. Just keep it going, put it on Woo! Hell yeah, why not? Alright. Those motherfuckers. So make sure you check that shit out. Like like he said, we got the NAP shit, the last of this shit. We'll play another dope ass NAP song. Uh, it's Halloween, so we're going spooky in this bitch. We're getting some fucking we're candy. We're playing everything I told you. horror related. Go ahead, got. come to this fucking house, dude. Do you think you're getting some candy? I'm yeah, getting yeah, you we'll take this. Go ahead. Are we going to get some candy? Oh, you're right. this fire ass mixtape. <laughs> Passing out my motherfucking mixtape all night, motherfuckers. My mustache is like really getting in my. It's getting. How right. do people with mustaches like this? Happy Halloween, brother. I drink and hit bongs and shit. Cheers, me, bitch. You lazy ass. I don't want to break your bong. This feels like feeble and shit. It's pink. You gotta use like a fucking pink bong. You know? He just straight. So what, man? He straight roasted your bong. He said it's feeble. Bro, I feel like I'm gonna set this mustache on fire. I can't see it <laughs> when I look down. <coughs> You're good. <coughs> oh, that's harsh. <coughs> hey, was this lighter? <coughs> nah, bro. Oh damn. <laughs> I hope you guys are smoking with us right now. But what right now are we talking about? Are we talking about next week right now as they're watching it? Or are we talking about right now on Halloween through the space-time continuum? You know what? I didn't really think about it, but since you gave me an option, I guess <coughs> really both. I hope when we were recording this, for some reason, you were just smoking today. And just then, like. You know, to me. Like I'd hate for you to do you do you like not having weed? Hell no. Are you looking bad over there? I'm dude, I'm struggling. But you know Sometimes what? the weed man don't answer the phone. It's it, the struggle is real. So well, you know what you do The though? problem is if the weed man don't answer the phone, you call the law offices what I'm into. They'll handle <laughs> that shit. Complaint. Actually, so I can get some weed right now if I wanted to, but I'm shooting this here podcast. Man, one of these times we're gonna have to take them on location. You know what? Send me about that. You want to take the world? No, to the no, weed no, man? not to the weed man. <laughs> that just happened to come right after we were talking about it. <laughs> but <laughs> I'm like, God damn, bro! No, no, no. Just, well, just live. Hey, we're guys. live on fucking YouTube, bro. What's up? <laughs> yeah. Uh, we'll bring the podcast on location live one time. Like, I, I don't want to wait till the gathering. No. But definitely, look. It's being said right here on Halloween, 10, 31, 18. We're putting this on record. Now, you know you putting records and shit last week? Yep. You was making records with the file? All right. <laughs> with, the court, with the court's attorney and shit? This is happening right now. We're saying it. He's saying it. I don't know if Next, I agree with this yet. 2019. This is going to be the year. Gathering of the Juggalos 20. It's going to be dope. My 11th appearance we will be doing the what up ninja podcast live 100 percent live straight to you motherfuckers from the gathering of the juggalos on location it's gonna be it's gonna fuck where up are we gonna own. where are we gonna set up that? i don't know we're just gonna bring well, like a fold-up table and, and we're just, just gonna just pop it out we're wherever gonna have the we're props at props and shit. just wherever we're yeah we're gonna have all the props yeah Okay. Have the fucking TV behind us too. <laughs> the generator. We're just gonna turn around. Bring right a black sheet and hang all the posters on it. Oh my god. <laughs> this whole 
<laughs> We're taking the whole office. The whole office. Oh my god. Gathering of the Juggalos 20. We don't. Got 30 no, seconds. No, see, we got 30 seconds. So what are we going to do? So what All right, gonna... so this next song is from the legendary NAP, Before Our Time, is the name of the album. You can cop it at Karma right now, four ninety nine. dollars We're about to play you the last track. If you want to check out any of the songs, you can go back through the podcast that we've been doing throughout the, what, two weeks? This will be the third week. Yeah. You can listen to the songs. They're pretty dope. Well, here, what are we doing? Are we rolling? It's rolling. Yep, you're good now. This is a song that I wrote to my... This is their remix. Look. I remember Ooh, that's hard. the first time that I fell in love. I dedicate this song to Weed. The first time that I fell in love. Okay. 
Time go cop that shit at Karma. Like I said, it's only four ninety nine. Remix coming soon. Holy shit! Maybe. Maybe we don't. We don't have a studio. We don't have a studio. Man. Anyway, we're gonna get down to brass tacks, dude. We are fucking back. I got something no, to talk we're about. Home with, with. We're back. No, 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 no. We're not back. No, we're not. We're not back. We got another <laughs> song. We're back, but we're not. We're not back because we're not back. Well, that's what I was saying. We're back. We're back. For the moment play until we shit. find some music. You already linked up to the Bluetooth. Yep. You ready to go? Play. Are you goose problem? Don't play no shit that's gonna get us monetized, motherfucker. I'm gonna play some shit that that'll get us monetized. <laughs> Sorry, if y'all don't want to fucking if y'all want to hear the shit that's not monetized, skip forward. Somebody skip help forward us about the website. Skip forward about twenty seconds, and if we're not there yet, then skip forward another ten. Somebody we help us build soon. the website, and we will fucking. Not ding ahead. ding! I didn't even think. I didn't even go live. Bam! Just jump right into it. Oh. Jump right into that shit. Skip, the motherfucking skip, 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 that shit will be dangerous. Where's that gonna be? So dangerous. I'm cold, hotter than the summer, going harder every year, working hard like a plumber. Told your bitch, watch your mouth, might make a swallow. At least I know when she do, she'll be back on me tomorrow. Big skills with the dollar sign, hold you like a rim to Fuck bitches, get money, that's all that's on my mind. Spitting, I'm quitting, ripping, I'm lipping. Got the loud in the rim, me taking shots, never sipping, hoes crazy, still pipping. OG is what I'm shipping, 40 clocks, it's all that I'm ripping. Need pants, be thugging, there's nobody I'm trusting, never found in love, only lusting. Can't pretend to be real for that, kick back, hip, get yeah, like a snap back. Don't think they wanna play with us. 
Since I've been in jammies Rappers start shit, boy, they know that them family Bang, bang, pistol, hope it ain't jammers Don't give a fuck, I'm a rap motherfucker I'm a bad Episode 9 is hot right now on What Up Ninja. You go to YouTube and check that out. You type in What Up Ninja. That shit's lit! It's gonna pop up. That is some crazy shit that happened there. Go check that shit out, because that shit is hot live right now. You're live with us right now on Facebook. We're shooting episode 10. You get a little sneak peek into what's going on. Taking a little music break. I'm B the Lucha. This is... What the fuck is your name, Tim? It's me. Really need a 
second we usually cut you live live motherfuckers off but because nick's on the line pause that shit pause that shit we're about to talk to nick for a second over here on this motherfucking podcast first off say what's up hey hold on stop that real quick bubba pretty please hold on i gotta leave for a second hold on (gasps) what are we gonna do He didn't even make a noise. <laughs> you know, sell motherfucker. You've been wor- so you're still working third shift. Yeah. I'm beginning to think that you don't like us anymore. You beat me up from work the other day. Uh, uh, this <coughs> mm-hmm. Are you living the American dream? Uh, I, don't I, I guess to some extent. Swear Some better than others, I guess. It sounds like Hank Hill. What? A, this is such a nice surprise, though, dude. Like, all right. So first off, we're live. We're we're still on YouTube, so I gotta keep fucking remembering. Oh, we're that, not. Man. Yeah, we are. I yeah. rerolled it. I, re- I I stopped it and rerolled it. So yeah, you guys. Are yeah. Oh, we're so, back. This is all on YouTube. We're back, motherfuckers. <laughs> We've been back <laughs> for like five back. minutes. We didn't even know it. He didn't know. Look, they got me on fucking camera. <laughs> I'm switching now. Again. That's why. <laughs> Well, damn it! You are the whole gimmick! <laughs> Fucked it all up, dude. Fuck that shit! <laughs> we were just fucking coming back from our music break, so we've been talking about music. Did you get to listen to any of the NAP album that we played throughout the weeks? Some of it, yeah. Okay, that better. You, if you would have said no, I would have hung up this call. <laughs> <laughs> What'd you think of that shit? Did you like any of it, dude? Come on, man. It's an AP. What you think? And, and it was that it had that NAP feel, and it like had some yeah. man. That shit was that shit was lit. Yeah, dude, I fucking loved it. Absolutely. Give me a physical copy of that. Karma Records. Karma Records, four ninety nine. Washington and Post Road. And while you're at it, while you're there, you can scoop up your new Nate the Ninja fucking CD, cause that shit is hot off the presses. Get the last one. What? Are you know what? I didn't get the last one. I got it. I didn't. I have it upstairs right now. I, I didn't get it either. It's on the Ottoman, bro. It's hey, like, it's became part that, of my life. That was a Gathering of the Juggalos <laughs> exclusive. That's Motherfucker, that was. I was at the Gathering of the Juggalos. <laughs> exactly, <laughs> that was a Gathering of the Juggalos. I, I, I did not get a copy. <laughs> I never received you, my You copy. showed up late, dog. I'm out. <laughs> this is how I feel about it. You, did. Yeah, you were there, bro. We were there. We, we were, were in there. The fucking, we, we were there the since mud. We was there since day zero. Day zero, motherfucker. We were naked. Yeah. Okay, first off, you 
I'm just talking shit. Shut the fuck up. Hey, look, about hey, calories. you guys, it don't matter. You guys can't give me no shit about that. Let's make sure we fucking play. You don't piss off Mr. Ghostface, okay? That motherfucker never dies. You like, don't tell you me. You better watch out before he gets shot about over here this camera. I was gathering when you was in fucking... We didn't go talk about hey, that. Motherfucker, we've been gathering since that. you was fucking weird. Dump the duns, motherfucker. Dump the duns, motherfucker. Dump the you feel me? It was like a Spongebob? And chilling? <laughs> no, he was like... Actually, He bro, was in like second, first grade. The second, the second <laughs> gathering... The second oh, gathering was the year I was born. All right, fuck that. Hold on, we're going to talk about that. All right, we're this one. No, right now. No, no. no yeah, bring him on. Come on. Hey, hey, All make right. the tripod. Would you please open the door? Because your homie, or well, your enemy or whatever is here. Make the motherfucking ninja in this What bitch. the fuck? That's right. I gotta set this up somewhere. Whoa. I'm in this bitch. There you are. Hey! Pull up, the, pull up a chair. You gotta go get the orange boy. Uh, man, fuck that chair. What? Mom, fuck this chair. That chair's alright. I like all right, that chair. I, I always just feel like we're above, like it feels like we're above motherfuckers when they be in this Yeah, I see why you guys say fuck this chair. Right. It's but I guess it's down. cool, though. Come over behind AJ, bub. That's crazy, bub. Let's talk about that. Since you guys ain't allowed to talk about that. Don't fucking get in trouble now. We're not. <laughs> uh, we, we don't All right. fucking condone any fucking... Welcome way. to the fucking podcast. You don't really have to worry about live so much <clears throat> as you do over here. Right. So, you see you do, over here? do you think... Are you uh, yeah, I should be able... Yeah. All right. So, what were you doing? What were you for Halloween... And you were seven years old. Dude, I'm not even gonna lie. Me and my, oh, yeah. like, as kids, we didn't go fucking trick or treating. Come on. Like, we went trick or treating probably maybe like four or five times. Like, pff, legitimately. Bro. Damn, Why? dude. What kind of childhood is that? Well, because we always looked at That's Halloween true. as like a family event. Like, we always spent that time together. You're supposed to spend it together. Yeah, but we candy. don't. We don't go and. So we never like we like we had our like trick or treat or whatever, but we just like we stayed yeah, home and watched movies good. and. Fucking ate pizza and fucking popcorn and shit. <laughs> you can acquire one of those beauties right there from the law. This is a what up ninja. Or from one of us. Like, we have them too. Alright, so. Here's what's going down. My birthday is coming up. And there's plenty of time to talk about it. But I want to get the fucking word out there. Ice Cube is about to fucking drop an album. Yeah. December 7th. That's going to be crazy. December 7th. That is my fucking birthday. Mega. That's gonna be crazy. So I've I've put I've put the request out there. Be the ninja, aka be the lucha, aka boo the ninja. Boo! I don't even know if you can hear that right from Ghostface. Like I probably sound fucked up right now. You just say boo normal. You're a ghost. You don't, boo! Why does a ghost have? Ah! Why does a ghost have to say anything? You're a ghost already. You just gotta just boo, motherfucker. I'm a ghost. Look, I'm home alone. <laughs> anyway, what do you think? Are you an Ice Cube fan, Nate? Man, fuck yeah. yeah. I mean, I mean, I'm not going to be like stereotypical and say because of the whole NWA thing, but me personally, I thought his disses were probably the most righteous ones ever just because of how deep no he was. No, no Vaseline. No Vaseline. I was more of a West Side Connection fan. I mean, I can... I, when we come to your town... I mean, don't get me wrong. Like Ice Cube had some tight shit. Like he had like today was a good day, right? That was tight. And then bow down to some bitches. That's great. He came out with that shit like back in like the early part of the 2000s too. It was that like what was it? If you scared motherfucker, go to church. And that shit was hard. That shit was tight. And then what was the other one? Smoke some weed. Well, the thing that's crazy to me is Ice Cube is the same. Ice Cube also has like an acting career too, and he's got an active career. Yeah, this shit was tight. What were you saying, Nate? I was, no, you're good. Then I was, we I was saying that, like, dance? throughout his whole rap career, though, like, not even his whole rap career, just, like, the half, last half end of it, he's had, like, a continuous, like, acting career, too. Hell That's yeah, dope. dude. And even since like, he was like, younger. He wrote the like, Fridays yeah. and shit. Nick, what do you have to say on the matter? Same thing like NAP, huh? 
Hey, are you gonna are you gonna buy that for me for my birthday? Someone better buy that shit for me for my birthday. <laughs> You're gonna have like ten <laughs> copies of it. One of y'all. Somebody out there in YouTube land or Granny, Facebook land. Granny. Somebody. Watch. You're gonna have like fifty copies. I don't care. Spot. Give me fifty right. copies. Mm-hmm. I'll right, let me get one, bro. I will. All right. If I get fifty. Like I'm so if I get two, I'm keeping. You're gonna get multiple, bro. You're gonna get like some copies. I don't we care. want copies. We don't want digital bullshit. You know, CD, compact, motherfucking disc. A disc. Send that shit to me in the mail, whatever. You got plenty of time to get it. Well, it comes out on my birthday, so you better overnight express it. What? Hell yeah. Hell yeah. P- Take care of boom. P- P- ninja. Yeah. Put that shit in my name, be the ninja. Or boom. The ninja works too. P.O. Box. That's not going to die, bro. Uh, What's not going to die? The boom ninja. <laughs> He's gonna keep it alive. That's, That's what I was, because we did some spooky shit, which we're about to talk about right now. Uh, no, we're not. Why not? Because we just now brought our guest on like it was. To talk about the spooky shit I with us. Gotcha. We got All some right. spooky shit. We at least gotta fucking give him some hype. But what about some the spooky fucking, shit? We're gonna talk about the spooky shit. Alright, give him some hype. Right. Look, 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 I look, fuck look, with Nick. This motherfucker, man. Alright, for y'all to fuck with us now, see us at shows and shit. Like, y'all know. I can't understand you. You can't. I know, because the fucking... Change gimmicks. But I'm on... Uh-oh, buddy. You better get on the table. All right, here's what we're going to do. Here's what we're going to do. Oh, uh, yeah, Merry Christmas. This is Be the Ninja with an advertisement announcement. Have you ever been locked inside your car because you're about to get the shit beat out of you by some gangbangers? Have you about to get gangbanged and you didn't have no Vaseline or lube and got gang banged raw and it hurt really bad. If you got child support payments that are way past due and they're about to fucking take your car, hit up the law offices of What Up Ninja. Since when do they take your car? What up, y'all? We're back in this bitch. Now I can be heard. Although, you know, I kind of lost my voice when we did that spooky shit that you were talking about. That spooky shit. It's weird. I don't know what happened. What the fuck's going on with you, dude? <laughs> I don't know. I'm like, put I'm falling apart. Put on a mask. What? What mask? I've already done. We're done them already? I've already had, so only had two. We're just going to take this off? No, no, no. The hell no, I'm a luchador, dude. You want I'm my gonna, mask I'm off? Gonna... You want my fucking mask off, motherfucker? All right, I'm tell you what. Pin me one, two, three. You want a gimmick, motherfucker? Pin me one, two, three. There and you go. Look, all right, look. All right, first I'm off. I'm gimmicked. First off. I'm gimmicked. The motherfucking champ is here. Okay, first off, Rey Mysterio. This is the motherfucking champ. All right, you see me over here. Be the lucha. What does it say? Fuck some shit up. What does it say? So what? What does that say? What does that say? Not for long. What does that say? Not for long. What does that say? Not for long. What does that say? Come this Sunday on pay per view live. Be the lucha takes on Naptown Ninja AJ for the title in a bloody death match of doom. It's going down. You guys can buy tickets to that right now at What Up Ninja. Slash law office slash file a complaint <laughs> because I sent money and didn't That's get the ticket. That's what you're gonna want to do. You're gonna want to file a complaint whenever you get your ass. I'm taking that. Fucking ring, I'm ring. taking that fucking belt. I know that. <laughs> you can talk all that talk now, but when it comes down to it, when you get your ass in that ring, you're in my fucking territory, buddy, and you don't forget it. <laughs> because if you want to forget, let's uh, talk about this. Oh, you can sit there and you can talk all your shit you want. But I've held this title longer than anybody in the history of this motherfucking championship. I have held this title undisputed for like six or seven years or some shit. Dude. I don't even remember. I'm mean, I... <laughs> This title is never leaving my side. I'm the fucking champ, and that's the way it's gonna fucking stay. For you motherfuckers, for you motherfuckers, for this motherfucker who's not even on fucking camera for you motherfuckers. Because you can cut your promo, buddy. To any uh, motherfucker. You see this? I'm coming for that time. That's their real shit. <laughs> it's a triple here. threat match. <laughs> it's a triple threat match. He said he's coming for that title, bro. It's the jug executioner. <laughs> now you sit there 
and you fucking talk all your, you, 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 you go on your little rant about how you're the champion and how you've been the champion for so long, but let's talk about that. Let's hash it out for a minute here, buddy. Why has that been? Because you're too fucking scared to get in the ring because you know as soon as you step in the ring with me, I'm going to pin your ass one, two, three, and that's going to be the end of your fucking long run. That's what I know. I know what it is. And I know I've been in the same room as a wrestling ring with you. And I just, and I, and I called you out. I told you to step in the ring. No, the title wasn't on the line. The title wasn't a part of the picture. But you didn't want none in a non-title, unsanctioned match. Because you fear, you fear that super omega superplex. You fear that shit. You know. Go get in the ring with me, because you're going to end up in that corner, and we're going to go for a fucking ride. This belt. Let me tell you something right now, son. When you get in that ring with me, it doesn't matter if you have a fucking super mega triple ultra suplex. The only reason why I'm stepping into that ring is because you got that gold. I don't care about you or any other piece of shit out there. You understand me? But when it comes down to that title... I'll do whatever it takes. And you best believe that when I step in that ring come Sunday, it's going to be over with for you. So you might as well get used to it now. You hold that title. You fucking love on it because you're going to fucking miss it. And I'm telling you right now, when your reign is over, long live the king because there's a new fucking era coming in. You know who it is. It's Be The Lucha. <clears throat> I hate to take a quote from a wrestler... Especially one that's not my top. You want some? Come get some. This is mine. And it's always going to stay that way. You see that shit? That shit wasn't cheap. <laughs> <laughs> that cost extra and shit. That motherfucker says, AJ, clean as fucking day. Right there. Along with, uh, what does it say right here? Oh, this is Raven. Oh, that's pretty nice. Look at you. This is Cactus, Cactus Jack. Jack. Holy hey, hey. shit. This looks like it said Sam Punk at some point. At some point, that little black mark right there. <laughs> I can definitely you make out what it right? said Sam Punk. Madman oh, this Pondo. Is a, this is a, wow. This, this is a really nice title. This bill has been... Man, I'm going to be so happy. I, I tell you what, when I win this from you Sunday... We're not going to do the Roman Reigns, When, I, when I win this more. from you Sunday... I'm going to appreciate this title. This is nice, dude. This is really nice, man. This is going to look good in my living room, man. I'm going to put it right up above my TV. It is going to look good. I'm going to keep the room. AJ on it, too. I'm going to leave it there to remind me how I beat your ass on Sunday. It is going to look good in your living room when I wear it in. And I show your wife who fucking daddy really is. <laughs> Champ is right here, motherfuckers. And right here for all of y'all. Stay tuned. What up, Ninja Wrestling? <laughs> Like, I don't know. Like, that's one of them question mark kind of fucking... All right, so we brought Nathan and John, and we didn't get Look, his motherfucking... it's my twin. We didn't get his Look, motherfucking... It's my, it's my twin. I can't see it. We have, we have to get me some. This is my new production of Blow Up Dolls. <laughs> All right, so look, we got the motherfucking homie, and we brought him on, and we just like totally put him in the corner. And we didn't we immediately shit. busted out a wrestling promo, which, which by the way, how was it? Uh, nah, you guys did fucking fantastic. I'm tripping balls, so it's just. Like... <laughs> <laughs> All right, so Nate the Ninja came prepared today. Hell yeah, I did. Can All I right, so what is what is this if rumor? I, if I can beef? have one of these, we can smoke one up in here. Right what, now. Yeah. What is what is with this rumored beef? Between between you and our and our fucking camera and our tripod. camera motherfucker make the tripod. Man, that motherfucker is a fucking cheap talking fucking. All right, we're getting bitch. the fuck off the live because we're getting into some shit that you can only check out if you tune into Ooh. What Up Ninja. Nick, it's been a pleasure fucking seeing your face, dude. We need to get together real soon. Make sure you fucking share the new podcast that just went live. Better protect your All fucking you motherfuckers candy. that are watching this right now at the end, even this one viewer that's probably Nick. Let me put one motherfuckers, one tune in. Yeah. What up, Ninja? We're YouTube talk about your podcast oh, going shit. down yeah. this week. Halloween, happy Halloween. Be safe out there. Then we're talk about here. what he said. Yeah, we'll talk, we'll talk about whatever ended up coming off the mind. Right. No, Brandon had a topic, but we're going to talk about... 
I do have a topic. Here. I have two topics. Nate the Ninja. For y'all, or for what is with this rumor though? Like, like we keep so, hearing about it. So, Trot Man, Nate the Tripod, he's just like. I want to ask, I want Nate. I no. want to ask you to hold on. Yeah, chill Let out, him bro, talk. Because I'm telling you right now, just, if, you touch him, if you touch him again, dude, you know he's underage. And if you touch him again, I'm going to fucking lay you out right here on the floor. Uh, dude. I swear, so you man. Fuck out. Nate, you, can't, you can't fucking fuck up the special guest. I don't want you guys to think that. Just Nate, let him talk. Nate Tripod and Nate the Ninja are two different entities. One of these days, y'all going to meet Nate the Tripod. One of these days. Um... Yeah, Alright, so what, 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 what's that beef? Why you don't have that beef? Just sit down. Just let him talk, bro. I've done heard your story a hundred times, man. I took your ass to the fucking drive through the other day. I had to listen to that bullshit, so shut the fuck up. And let All him right. talk. Alright, so he's just like, you know, we was at... You remember that show back uh, at the Mercury show? Man, that motherfucker... Uh, y'all was up front get, getting some footage of him or some shit, and man... Motherfucker just kept on turning around, flashing his fucking flashlight in my face and shit. So I fucking mean mugged him after the show when he was a little bitch and didn't say shit. Damn, dude. He was talking like, about it. Man, seeing that's the thing, like, I, I want to have a civilized conversation with him, but I don't feel like he's ready for that. See, because if hey, he has to get... I told you to sit down. If, if, Look, you know what? Hold on. This is about to be a whole Howard Stern scene Hold in on. here, goddammit. <laughs> Tripod, get, get... You gotta go, man. Todd... Come over here and get this camera. Just don't move it. Just he's got it right. All right. So Suzanne, right, will you please make sure that he closes the door? No, don't go let him back in here. So, motherfucking, well, just yeah, man. I just like quietly, I, please, I, Susan. I fucking yeah. mean mugged the fuck out of him, and he didn't do shit about it. I mean, that's just how that was. I mean, fucking Nate the tripod's a bitch, I guess. Oh shit! Bro, let's talk about this. Hot hardest ass words. I, I'm I'm done with the drama, man. <laughs> I'm so tired of hearing him. For y'all that don't know, Nathan Ninja is part of motherfucking our fucking conglomerate fucking, company. Fucking what up, Ninja Entertainment, motherfucking what up, Ninja? Where we NG. say fuck, fucking fuck. And that's our motto. That's our yeah. that's our company motto. Yeah. Pretty much. Fuck. Fucking. What fuck. do you guys represent? The fuck. 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 The fuck. <laughs> And weed. <laughs> the four letter word. And, fuck. And weed. I live by the four letters. <laughs> F for fuck. Y for Come on, cookies. man. Come on. And, and the K is for kick rocks. Kick rocks. If you don't fuck with I agree with that last yeah. one hard. I'm with that. Fuck you if you're hot. Cookies, kick rocks. Fuck you if you're hot. I agree with that one hardcore. Fuck you if you're hot. We also, also by the letters, <laughs> also by the word <laughs> weed. Yes. Whatever. Edible. Edible. And that's the word of the day. Enjoyed. That's the word, that's the word of the day is weed. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> word of the day is weed. Whatever edible and this, this week's episode is also brought to you by the law offices of What Up Ninja. Uh, if you got any kind of fucking issues, the motherfuckers will handle it for if you. If you have ADHD and you just want to let it go, this is the fucking channel you, you know tune into. Let me speak on the fucking law offices of What Up Ninja real quick. Man, these motherfuckers, man. So back in the summertime, I just happened to go with one of the the purely this is purely speculation at this point, but one of the representatives of the oh, law allegedly. Of, allegedly allegedly one of the one of the representatives of the law offices of what up ninja to the uh, we went to the Freedom Springs back this summer and man I, I just want to say when you got that badass in ground toenail some shit like that man fucking nasty ass fungus um, but with that said man uh, fucking. The homie B the Ninja decided that he was going to lose his glasses, and I hit up the law offices of What Up Ninja, and they got his glasses back and beat up the kid who stole them. So, I mean, there's that. Fucking, that was a save. That was a save of the day for that one, for that cause. And there's pure speculation. I don't know why people think I'm always beating up kids. Man, it wasn't you. It was the law offices of What Up Ninja, but that was purely speculation. Allegedly. Allegedly. No, dude, I'm saying, like, you know, like, I don't know why all these kids have been coming up missing lately. It's a luchador mask. Like, so you just put out your first motherfucking yeah official you. fucking release. Yeah, and motherfucking on oh, what up this ET. Yeah, and man, that shit is cold, bro. Like, let's talk about that for a minute. If y'all, do, do you have it with you? Uh, I actually have like a whole bunch of different copies in my book bag over there. Okay, well let's we'll get that in a second. We'll get it after the break. And if you guys catch the last podcast, you'll see my fucking I eat pussy CDs all over that motherfucker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We didn't even talk about it. We meant to. That's how fucked up you had last week. Shout out to Nasty for that shit. All right, so 
He came out with the new, with the, with the first official fucking release. Uh, man, how's, how's the fucking... Dude, man, the, it's... How's the response? I mean, honestly, like, I've... When it comes to, like, local artists, I've been giving them the CD. Um, just oh, to yeah. network a little bit so they can hear what I got. But, like, uh, I've been really... I, I have been able to sell these to people I don't know. Like, it, because of how well I put together all of the uh, make. And it wasn't just me... I can't take credit for it all, really. My homie Tone Def, the other part of uh, Zaniax Productions, he fucking helped with that shit. Like he supposed to be here, motherfucker. And hey, Man, look, the reason he ain't here is because he is off working at a dope ass fucking video and taking care of his kids. And stay tuned for that fucking video. The video that fucking the single hatred will be released see, soon. See how you put oh, kids yeah. in there, man? This look like like terrible people. <laughs> what happened? Because he knows if he brings them over here, I'm stealing their candy. <laughs> y'all hey, man, coming here to get candy. He's gonna steal that. That's candy. how I lured y'all. He in. was like, he's taking care of his kids. Like we're not. Oh, we get because we're doing this for y'all. You got people taking care of your kids. You're all good. Yes. <laughs> my kids are. My kids. That's all that matters is that your kids are good. My kid, actually, my son could probably lose a couple pounds. He's getting a little chubby. Hey, look, you fucking, you're doing good on raising them fucks. That's all I gotta say. Hell yeah, dude. <laughs> those fucks. <laughs> fucking kids. Those. <laughs> if they were here, if they were here, I'd steal their candy too. Don't get it twisted. They would get checked. Hell that's yeah. Why that's why I'm not taking them trick or treat. That's why I'm excited to take my kids trick or treat. What you think? Yep. All your milk. I hit up all the spots. We're taking all your Milky Way. Hey, I, hit, I hit up all the spots too. See, like now as an adult, you can fucking like drive, right? You can go like you can't really trick or treat, but when you're an adult with kids, you can take them to all the shit. So like I take them to the nursing homes and let all the old people go and hand out candy and I fucking take them to the little trunk or treats and let them all right, all right, all right. Since This is me all Halloween and like trick or treating and all that shit. Man, this is a good fucking this is a good topic right here. All three of us. Look go how down dark the line. It is outside. Did the sun come up today? Like, I don't know. Like, what the fuck? We're always here at nighttime. Like, how in the fuck? It's a moon. Well, I guess. Cool. I guess it's kind of. Why well, is it shining. dark over there? But yeah, it's light over it's here. So dark over there. I was like, God damn, it is <laughs> dark. I thought it was nighttime shit. <laughs> All right, we're used to the nighttime shit. We're not used to doing the waking. We're narcoleptics. Yeah, you gotta think like. I straight up, I didn't even wake and bake. Y'all are used to us fucking like doing this, and we've been partying all day and pre-gaming and blah blah blah. Hell no, we just woke up. I got up, grab my seat. See, but the thing is, is, is we talked about it earlier. You, in, in order to wake and bake, you have to in order yeah. to, to get to sleep. So you let me tell you what I did. First I was like, I had a great idea. I was like, I'm gonna lay in bed. I'm gonna watch Harry Potter, and I'm gonna go to sleep because it's a long movie, right? Yeah. Three Harry Potters later. <laughs> Three long ass Harry Potters later. I'm and, still in twenty bowls. Shit. I need to go through and watch them all again. My How many bowls do you think you went through? Dude, I smoked my whole entire quad yesterday. Just through the Harry Potter movies? Well, like through the eve I got it in the evening time. Man, you were chiefing like a motherfucker. That's what I was doing, I was just blowing watching it. I was like, man, fuck it, I'll fall asleep. I knew I was gonna be up all I knew I didn't have to work. So I, what are you going as? Huh? What are you going as? Uh, you know what? Nothing. What do you mean nothing? You gotta wear something. It's, what, are, are you, like, what are you? What are you doing? What are you? Gonna Actually, wear? honestly, I thought about going as like taking like the flannel and cutting the sleeves off of it, right? And then like having like the trucker hat, <laughs> and then like having like the arm with like a bunch of names on it all crossed out. <laughs> that would be dope. All right. Like I'll go through. I'll all put right. them all on here. I'll put Kimberly, cross out. <laughs> Miranda. Fuck that stupid bitch. Cross if you out. look, if you're watching this right now, and you know who the fuck that stupid dumb cunt bitch is, tell her to go chuck on a dick. Or in seven. Some shit like that. She probably does she that. Probably already did. For enjoyment. <laughs> fuck that. That's purely that's speculation, like, though. No, that's probably real talk. That's real shit. <laughs> yeah, there's, there's like six or seven in her mouth right now as we shoot this podcast. Great. And they all have, like, stuff on them. It's some fucked up shit. Uh, now that's some scary shit for your ass. <laughs> Halloween, motherfuckers. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. Like, I'm supposed to get scared on Halloween, right? All right, so you're going to do that. I'm going purging, motherfuckers. Halloween. I know a lot of you motherfuckers are because I work in spirit, and I'm a little shitty about that, but I picked it a while ago, and then all you motherfuckers jumped on the bandwagon. So you really, y'all followed me. <laughs> and this shit. If you want to fucking make the ninja, what are you fucking wearing? What are you rocking? Man, for fucking Halloween, in all honesty, man, I'm fucking, I'm, I'm rocking these, I mean, I'm rocking these tabs of acid. 
See, <laughs> so you never know what he's gonna be wearing later. I mean, I don't know. Well, I might not be wearing. You might be running around in the Michael Myers sheet. I might not with be glasses. If, on the outside. if I fuck around too much, I might not be wearing nothing later. I don't know. I, mean, I thought about maybe fucking like getting a bucket. I have like all white clothes. You should, clothes. You should dress up as Nate the Tripod. That would be fun. I should, man. And then like this, <laughs> this Nate the Ninja the whole time. Dude, that would be funny as hell. That would be super funny. Like now that he's not in here and shit. Uh, fucking, what was y'all's favorite? Your favorite thing back. Dig through the clouds, and smoke blow through. Go back. What was your absolute favorite costume that you ever rocked? Go back. Dude. Well, you don't have to go back. Maybe it was it last sounds, year. It sounds so corny and so cheesy, but we, I, uh, one year, my mom really, like, I was the only one who was going trick-or-treating the one of the years, and, uh, we, like, bought, like, three different costumes and put together, like, a, like, a really fucking gangster version of Ghost Rider between like a Fantastic Four costume and a fucking biker outfit, so like I used the Fantastic Four thing to like on my head, like the flames on top of my head with like a skull mask to look like the Ghost Rider. That was like we made like a homemade one. It was like probably my most favorite, other than you know the standard Michael Myers one that I always rocked like almost three times. <laughs> B. Luta, my favorite one man is I went. One year as Batman, right? It's probably the only time I ever went as Batman, but I was a kid, dude. But I remember, like, I had the fucking gun that had, like, the hook on it. When you shot it, it had the little rope that kind of went with it, but it was, like, real low budget, right? And then, like, I had, like, the fucking... The, I remember having the belt, the yellow belt that had, like, the... Or the gold belt that had the Batman on it, and mm -hmm. it had, like, these little... Like, you'd click the belt, and it would push out the little stars and shit. You had the Lux, man. Yeah, dude, I had, like... It was, like... You had, like, the bat suit. Well, it, it was Granny, bro. Hell, yeah. Like, granny said, fuck that, we get the best. You want to be Batman? You will be Batman. Yeah, dude, it was, like... It was a dope-ass costume. It had, like, all the bells and whistles and shit, dude. Like, it was, like, right around the time that Batman Forever came out. The George Clooney one or whatever. So like, bat nipples? Did it have bat nipples? Did your con did your costume have bat nipples? No, wait, no, no, no that was Batman and Robin, right? But he no, had bat nipples. Maybe. I got them confused. <laughs> I mean, oh, no, Robin. what are we getting into? The Joel Schumacher one. We're getting into anyway, bat that nipples. Was really cool. I, that one always stands out. I remember wearing that at school, man, and just like I thought I was the shit. Yeah, had, like, look, yeah, yeah, school, uh, fucking. What's this when they don't let the kids have Halloween parties and shit at school and rock your costume on Halloween and what the fuck is that shit? I mean, I did, I even I didn't get. Cause that everybody didn't get that shit. I didn't get what that. Oh, that was the shit. Everything is like so fucking politically correct now, dude. It's like you can get in trouble for. All the way up to middle school, it's like right? You can offend everybody now, dude. It's like. It's ridiculous. Bro, like, this, kids, this like whatever happened to just, like, fucking having tough skin, man, and the fucking world was mean, and sometimes it shit you out, and you had to fucking overcome, you know what I mean? Like, that's a... I was, like, what the fuck happened, For y'all that don't know, for y'all that... Which, we, according to our viewership, we don't really fucking have underage motherfuckers fucking with us anyway, so... A lot of you motherfuckers... Do y did y'all have fucking el in elementary and middle school? Were you just all day on Halloween to rock your costume and shit? Dude, I remember we at had the end like of the day, you Christmas didn't really... parties in yeah, different yeah. classes. No, you shit. can't say Christmas. It's a holiday party. What the fuck? So it's a holiday. That's party. what I'm saying. Because you offend. Like first off, I'm not saying like the way that I feel is you celebrate whatever fucking holiday you want. But how are you going to tell me that I offend you? Because I represent because shit. I'm celebrating this and I can't celebrate this because this is how I say it. Like, why can't I just say to you, have Merry Christmas, and you look at me and say Happy Hanukkah? You know right. what I mean? Like, what the fuck, dude? Like, all right, you. Well, and uh, dude, they was gonna fucking try to call me. Like, they was trying. To... Yeah, exactly. Like, why the fuck? Whatever you celebrate, why can't you just like fucking say that back to me, dude? Like, why does it have to be offensive? Why does everything have to be the whole like? Controversy thing, like yeah, because like, why like when you go necessary? into when you go into like Dollar Generals now, they will not say Merry Christmas to you. They will say Happy Holidays, just because of the fact Merry Christmas symbolizes the fact of any type of Christ. Fuck that! Look, catch me, look, y'all know I be telling y'all where I be at. I be in the popping spots. I'm right now I'm still a spirit Halloween, but here in a couple weeks, catch me at motherfucking Spencer's. 
And at Spencer's, when you come in that bitch, if I'm greeting your ass, motherfucker, you getting a Merry Christmas. You ain't getting a Merry Xmas. And if you getting waited you on getting by a... me at a fucking table, mm-hmm. I'm telling you Merry Christmas. And if you got a problem with it, dude, we Not can... a Happy Holidays. We can talk not about that. Because I'm going to give you this philosophy right here. Yeah. All right, so if you're Muslim... Why would that offend you? Because you don't celebrate that? All right, cool. You don't celebrate that. Like, am I... I'm not offended that you're Muslim. You know what I mean? Why should you be offended because... You know what I mean? Like, why can't... It's kind of ironic. Why can't... Started talking about Christmas right after Halloween. Just why like, can't we... Why can't we like teach each other? Cards. You know what I mean? I don't really like... I like Thanksgiving for the food, but I know exactly, like, the country and how we came in here and, like, we pillaged and plundered and fucking we came in like we pirates and... Out, you know, like, the, Indian, the Indians... I feel bad for that, and I know there's nothing I can do about it but support the situation. That's why they won't... That's why but, they won't give any, like, people outstanding, like, with signs any money because they're afraid we're going to spend it on, like, deviled eggs or something, bro. They won't give us any money. The Indians just won't do it. They'll be like, don't do that. They'll spend it on deviled eggs. It's just how it is, bro. Hey, look. <laughs> <laughs> Motherfuckers, we look the views of the of Nate Dimension does not necessarily mean <laughs> 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 any of his subsidiaries. This, this fucking message has been brought to you by the law offices of Winnipeg. Winnipeg. <laughs> Have you ever been caught up in some shit that you didn't want to be in, but you had to do something, but you're broke as fuck? Have you ever passed a blunt to that motherfucker that you really didn't want to smoke with anyway, and you give it back to you and it's wet than a motherfucker? Did your baby mama come through and put a brick through your window? Sometimes. <laughs> have you Have you ever been so upset about the transgender situation that you fucking, <laughs> that you went and posed with some fucking ugly ass transgenders? Purely I speculation. I thought they were like, man, okay. It makes me wonder, dude. Yeah, dude, fuck. I'm not right. saying. I'm no, not no, saying no. that I would fuck. Well, we with you, but I'm just saying, like, you know. No, not, not that's not what it made me wonder about. That's what it made you wonder about. <laughs> No, I was just saying because like makes you wonder because people are like oh you thought they were attractive. I'm just saying like I'm comfortable enough in my sexuality to say that I didn't think that like they were ugly. I knew that we don't give good. a fuck and we talk about anything and everything on this bitch. Um, Ouija recently did exactly what we just said. Why? Well, Here's what I want to know. Here's what I'm gonna get controversial. I'm we, 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 like, are you getting scared of the controversy? All right, I'll just make sure you don't, because controversy creates cash, motherfucker. You know, well, what are we getting about. controversial about? Because. Yeah. Is it some shit that really I, I just gonna, don't care about? It's going to be controversial. Just wait. <laughs> <laughs> you know if it's coming out of my mouth, it probably is. <laughs> All, right. All right, so we wait just did me. some picture, uh, and he once again supported transgender, which, hey, we support you to do. We're not going to say we support transgender. We don't support you. We support any and everybody to do you. Like, that's how I've always been. If you gay, be gay. If you fucking, if you like fucking lamps, I mean, fuck a lamp, right? Like, do you have any problem with somebody to like, hey, man, I'm, in this, I'm in love cool. with this TV, and that's their, like, they're for real. Like, they're, you don't have a problem. I'm stuck that he just said Does it affect you in any way? Does it affect you in any way if somebody's in love with their fucking dog? No, but it actually, yeah, that does affect me. Like, I'm grossed out by that. Well, you know, I know. It does gross me out. Well, okay, it's a dog. I didn't say dog. Hey, man, they television. And I'm kind of worried They're about... They're in love with their television. And I'm kind of worried You're about married. anybody who's fucking a lamp. Well, I mean... If that's the thing, then maybe they... I mean, what type of freaky shit are you on, dog? <laughs> right, bro. <laughs> Where are you going? I don't know. But anything... He's going into some dark fantasies. I'm not fucking to do anything that they want to do. You know what I'm saying? But what I wonder is why is this a constant thing with Ouija Mac? I think he just wants to be like controversial he did, himself. He did the shirts a while back. <coughs> and he wanted well, to donate to like to some shit for the shit, car. Like, yeah, like all the transgender shit. Like why? Well, and I think my insight on it is that this generation that he's like preaching all of his music to has a lot of that going on in this generation. Like, it's becoming more uh, socially Yeah, it's acceptable. a different time, and, and it's, it's a different era. Dude. And, 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 and be, to be 100, um, it's kind of like the same thing he's doing with, like, his Japanese promoting. It's just a different way to get some controversial shit. Like, he takes all of his music, and he translates it to Japanese and then promotes his music overseas. And that's a controversial way of doing things, just like with going with the transgender scene he is trying to be that controversial dude, and going with things the amount of memes that he like he had to have thought about it right like when he, when he went and did that like oh this is gonna fucking create some fucking I don't know maybe that's what it was maybe it was all about controversy creating cash 
Where's my motherfucking face? <laughs> Fuck y'all. We was getting your ass. We did it one time. <laughs> He's like, man, I ain't had that motherfucker for a minute. <laughs> He's like, where did that go? I only hit it twice. <laughs> hey, the battery's done. I got a new battery if you need it. It's not dying. It's just turning off. This, this is fuck y'all. <laughs> he said, Now I'm pissed. The vape ain't being here's my situation. My, my, my own problem Ouija, Ouija, Ouija. Every show that we've been to recently, right? Ouija. I mean, and he's and what sometimes the fuck he's, happened to light? And sometimes he's not even announced. Psychopathic for y'all that don't even fuck with the jungle scene, but just fuck with us for whatever we do. Hey, we're keying y'all in on some info. Psychopathic. Picked up two artists right around the same time, right? Right. Light was probably like a month before, maybe. Something, it was like real close. Light and Ouija Mac. All right, so when they picked them up, they were both on every show, right? Would you Would you agree? We've seen Light and Ouija together a hell of times. They even did their fucking seminar at the gathering together. Um, where the fuck is Light? Not who the fuck is Light. We know who Light is. Light's a dope ass motherfucker. He's probably in the studio, dude. I bet you 2019 he drops an album. Well, I, I'll, I'll say me. I bet you. I bet you he drops one before 2019. If not, he drops one around the same time as the Furious Fred Fury drops, which of course oh, got the fucking shit. date pushed back. Bullshit. Yeah, because the last time we talked, we didn't have that info. We actually got it right. October 26th. We had every intention. Every intention of coming on the Halloween podcast episode 10 and discussing the new yeah, Joker's cool. card Joker card number 4 the great Malenko of the second deck you know what I'm saying we didn't plan on discussing it in full right and unfortunately ICP said nah <laughs> well they heard Nate the you ninja, ain't doing it they heard Nate the ninja was, was like releasing some shit the same day and was like man we can't do that like we're gonna get murdered like, it's just, you know how that So it is. didn't happen. I know you sold out first day, didn't you? Yeah, I did, man. Fucking 500 fucking copies. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Nah. He, he went triple He's aluminum. doing numbers, dude. He's doing numbers. He went numbers. triple aluminum the first day. Triple aluminum. That first day. I remember that, dude. It was a big-ass hubcap. <laughs> swear to God. I ain't started off a Cadillac. I said, I swear to God. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> hey, look. I couldn't lie if I wanted to. I don't even know, like... He sold out. He made... Nate the Ninja, I'm going to have to ask you a favor. Since we kicked out Nate the Tripod because of y'all's beef, Man, could you do that. me a favor and check the time? How am I going to have to do this? Yeah, you don't have to, to, don't have to hold the camera. We got Todd handling it, but Todd's a dumbass. Tom don't know. How are you going to have Tom or Todd or whatever his name know, don't know how to his read? His name is both. His name is Tom Todd. His name Tom is Tom Todd. Todd. What? So Tom what Todd. made y'all to go hire a retard All like that? that? He, can't, he can't tell time. Well, it looks like it's been rolled over to the next video how about 27 you seconds. You got, you're in 27 seconds on this one. All right, so then we'll go in about another couple minutes and then we'll go to fucking commercial break. Um, Dude, the social media is jumping. Because it's Halloween. Like All right, now look, crazy. for y'all that don't know, we discussed, we straight up, it's Halloween, we got shit to do, we got the kids and shit, we got to fucking get them ready, all kind of shit, right? Um, we, we, we definitely discussed not giving you an authentic Halloween video. Now, we would have said it was Halloween, right? <laughs> we had every intention of that. We had every intention of pretending it was Halloween, but we were going to shoot this shit on Tuesday or on Thursday this week, right? Right. However, we decided to fuck that. Give them that real, real. And it really is Halloween for y'all that don't believe us and shit. Well, no, they know. <laughs> Those motherfuckers know. If you don't believe us, catch us. I can't tell you to catch us nowhere because we're not live. Nope. <laughs> it's Halloween. Go check out podcast episode nine. All right. right now. Yep. After this, no, not so right now. we're gonna play some more music and then we're gonna come back and we're gonna fucking have some more conversation with motherfucking Nathan Ninja. He's not going nowhere. You staying? I'm staying. He's staying. He's staying for the long haul. So we're gonna fucking keep him here. We're gonna fucking we're gonna play you some music and we're gonna come back and we're gonna talk about a bunch of shit. Big wrestling shit happened this week. Yes. History making shit, like straight up. So we're gonna talk about that. We're gonna talk about some of the shit we did. 
over this past week since episode nine, since since nasty got us drunk as fuck, and it changed our whole live perspective. And like we like we went out and did some crazy shit this week based on that, right? Yeah. What you say? Yeah. So stay tuned, motherfuckers. Check out the music, some dope shit, and then we'll be back. Play that shit. Play the fucking track! Play the motherfucking song! We're rolling. Check out, motherfuckers. It's fucking Halloween. We were gonna do some different shit, but we're gonna give you the fucking video reaction later and shit to this new video because the sound wasn't quite there. Uh, but we're gonna go ahead and bump some of that motherfucking Halloween shit. Fucking shout out to the homie fucking Crow to Crow, Big J, RIP. I feel like Jimmy Infinity. It is a rain. I'm 
was just a group of hoes when it came to me with open thighs. You know she let me go inside. You need to look with open eyes. Jimmy, you feel me, the bitch? Lyrically, I'm joking, guys. motherfucking third time played on a podcast by because I like this fucking song and it's fucking morbid and it's fucking dark and it's fucking dope and fucking it's Halloween motherfuckers bright red J-Mo motherfucking KB slash taco fucking that dope shit Yeah, I found it, but it accidentally fucking... I'm so ready to go. I'm gonna let the motherfucker on this shit introduce this motherfucking track. Motherfucking hatred. Like on the box, right? They had the artist introduce it. Yeah. Hey, you motherfuckers, watch out for the music video to Hatred coming out. By the time this shit is out, that shit should be out, so make sure you watch out for it. Murder, 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 and I wanna fucking hurt him Cause I hurt myself and the blood fucking squirted And I'm still alive so I know it didn't work I fucking pray to God but I'm scared to go to church The next time I go it'll be in a hearse I scream every day that I'm glad it ain't worse You just wanna eat 
but you don't wanna work. You always receive, but you don't wanna serve. You say you're going crazy, but you never fucking learn. My heart is always hurting, and I really feel the burn. The way I fucking do things is none of your concern. When I start killing bitches, better never say a word. I think it's really funny, all the rumors that I heard. You applied on the first, got checked by the third. I ate all my dinner, now I'm ready for dessert. Don't blame with my name, cause I'll throw yours in the dirt. Get back, click, clack, I'm gonna rip that thought at me, and I'm gonna sit back. Thank your girl, now I get your bitch back. Fuck the world, we know who said that the fucking F town. Always will I rep that for my city. Never forget that, don't argue with me. You never get the lift back. All the bullets coming in the big bag. MGK should've never did the diss track, cause all he fucking did was call you a bitch back. Trying to hide the rabbit when you should've used the big hat. Talked about my daughter and it never would've been that. Run up in your house with a gun to your skull cap. A lot of pussy motherfuckers don't even know rap. Get the swinging blades, make your goofies do a whole lap. I'm sorry for the way that I'm feeling. I'm gonna go serial killing. Go Michael Jackson, call me Quilla. Ain't nobody fuck gorilla. I'm going so crazy with the drugs in my veins. All this alcohol trying to wash away the pain. Bled through my heart and on my shirt has a stain. All fucking red with the nose full of cane. But the drugs never work when you're going insane. Murder, murder, murder. And I want to fucking hurt him because I hurt my and the blood fucking squirted And I'm still alive so I know it didn't work I fucking pray to God but I'm scared to go to church The next time I go when they'll be in a hearse I scream every day that I got it even worse You just wanna eat but you don't wanna work You always receive what you don't wanna serve You say you're going crazy but you never fucking learn My heart is always hurting and I really feel the burn The way I fucking do things is none of your concern When I start killing bitches better never say a word I think it's really funny all the rumors that I heard You applied on the first, got checked by the third So we're fucking with y'all. We're back. We was here the whole time. But we're back with audio. Got y'all. Uh -huh. Halloween pranks. Trick or treat, bitch. We gave you the <laughs> trick. Now we want a treat. I ate that shit. Motherfucker. I ate that shit. But I had them treats ready. So, because of the spirit of Halloween, we've been doing some shit. We're back. We fucking Man, we did some shit. Hold on. Let's first talk about what happened just the other day in wrestling, motherfucker. The women's evolution. History. The women's evolution. Evolution, the first ever all women pay per view. Man, they brought motherfuckers from way back. They brought Molly Holly's fucking giant, fucking luscious ass back. 
Her fucking mm. her, I don't know why her hair is still short. Like after all these years, of the book, like grow that shit. Grow your fucking hair back, Molly Holly, to go with your fucking scrumptious ass. That's a nice booty. It is. It really and it stayed it stayed the course of time. I saw Trish Stratus lost her whole ass. Lost her whole ass, dude. No ass. Trish used to have one of the best asses in wrestling, and now it's just it like was, she yoked that shit it was off. All padding. She yoked that shit away. It was all padding. Man, don't tell me that. You're fucking up my whole childhood here. You know what I mean? Fucking, man. It was tight, dude. You know what What I really liked about it was that fucking last match, dude. Like, that was what really caught my eye. I really enjoyed that match a lot. I like, have not watched the last match. <laughs> you didn't watch it? I look. It was stupid ass late at night. We got home. We watched all of it until right before the two main events was the two title matches. Which I thought the battle royal was off the fucking chains, man. It like it was, that was better good. than some royal rumbles. And, and what's shit. crazy, dude, is like I expected it to end really fast, and it actually it was kind of like entertain. Like you know what I mean? Oh my like, god! It, lasted, hold on. it was you. You watched it. See, I didn't know until today if you had watched it or not. <laughs> Let's talk about Trucker Tammy, and I mean, I wonder <laughs> fucking boys. <laughs> Holy shit, did you see the beard, the beard guy, bro? Yeah. It was, it was rough. Yeah. Looking at fucking... Trucker Tammy. That was exactly what popped in my head when she came out, she said. And her belly was like... For people that don't know who Trucker Tammy is, <laughs> Trucker Tammy is Holy shit. a gimmick that I came up with. And were we here or was it Detroit? It was here. No, it was... I don't know. I think it was here. It was here. CCW. CCW. Circle City Wrestling. It was Trucker Tammy versus Newport. <sighs> Hey, this Alundra Blaze looked rough than a bitch. She just got off of a 24-hour fucking heroin binge, and she was drinking beer. Lots and lots of beer. Someone was looking very scared. You haven't seen the very end when all the ladies lined up outside on the ramp and waved goodbye? No, I haven't seen it. Like I said, Damn, the last dude, thing I've seen... slacking, bro. i seen the, the, the Kyrie Zane versus um, the other UFC horsewoman chick. Um, she took the NXT Women's title. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was the last match I seen. Okay. So the next match would have been, I don't know if it was Nikki Ronda Bella Rousey. And Ronda Rousey. Okay, so the main event was Charlotte and Becky Lynch. No, no, no. Charlotte and Becky, Becky Lynch. Lynch was yeah. there, and then Ronda Rousey. Yep. Becky Lynch fucking beat that ass. So dude. The last woman standing match. I'm pretty. I'm gonna watch it. I'm, I'm intrigued as fuck to watch it. So you didn't get to see either of the main events? Bro, I haven't got to watch Damn, Raw just, or SmackDown because I, just, I don't want to ruin... I just ruined it for I, you. I, no, I didn't hear you, so... Okay, perfect. Uh, I haven't watched Raw or SmackDown. I watched SmackDown last night. Can I tell you one thing about SmackDown no, last night? No, because it'll ruin the paper. Just one match. Evolution. No, it's just one match. All right, what happened? It doesn't even have to do with the women. All right, what happened? I watched Nakamura versus Rey Mysterio last night. Oh, that happened last week. I didn't get to see last Ray, week. Rey won week. last week to qualify... For the fucking World Cup fucking Not WWE more World Cup tournament. Out of here. Let's fucking touch on that shit. The WWE World Cup tournament is basically a King of the Ring tournament. Yeah, but it's based out it's, of all And it's happening at Saudi... No, it's not. <laughs> no, it's not. It's not? No. They don't have people from the UK? No, there's, there's, here's, the, here's the lineup. They don't have people from the UK? Uh, no. <laughs> but here's the lineup. First match is Seth Rollins taking on Bobby Lashley. This is the first round, right? And then Kurt Angle's taking on Dolph Ziggler. Uh, who else is in that shit? Jeff Hardy's in it. Rey Mysterio's in it. Um, John Cena's in it. What's that thing that they do in the UK and shit? That tournament? Oh, uh, the UK fucking... They, it's like the fucking... Um, hey, that match was good, too. Before I forget about that. The end of the May Young tournament. Oh, yeah, the yeah, final, yeah. that chick is going to be a fucking badass wrestler in the near, like, watch. You're going to see her on Raw, smashing some shit. Some of these new females are, what are you doing? Just looking. <laughs> see, that's what happens. If you're stoned and your homie's stoned and your homie just starts looking at some shit, you all, you're, you're going to be like, what the fuck is it? It's a giant moth, bro. I've been catching mice, bro. In the ceiling? I caught two yesterday. I sealed off a bunch of their passageways, dude, so they're like... Did you think you seen a mouse ass hanging out there? I thought, it, I thought I saw something. Anyway, we're back. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that chick is going to be dope. The chick that won the Mae Young tournament, I'm not, I don't remember her name, 
right now because I just probably smoked it out of my brain. But uh, the World Cup tournament is going to be dope. Uh, it's happening in Saudi Arabia this Friday, which means if you're watching this, you miss that shit. If, you, if you're waiting to see this, but you, but you, you can go still it. watch it. On the WWE Network. For just nine ninety nine. Hell yeah. You Motherfucking, can get that shit. that's the shit. Hey, look. We are they are not our sponsors by any means, but we'll tell you to go to WWE fucking network fucking and pay nine 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 because that shit's worth it. Right or wrong. Like I've been paying you since day everything one. you can fucking watch. I've been paying since day I one. I know to the point where like you get ready to cut off and it's like, already cuts off and you're like, oh shit, I gotta go put some money in the fucking shit. Nope, I don't even have Hold to up. Do I don't even have to do that no more. But you remember them days. Yep. They'd be off for a day, like, no! Yep. You'd be go to watch yeah. something, I would sit down on a day off and be like ready to watch it and eat some lunch and that shit wouldn't be on. I'd have to leave and go to the store and put The whole history, car. WCW, ECW, WWE, Mid-South Wrestling, and so many, Smoky Mountain, so many different wrestling, everything, there's, like, anything you want to watch. Original on, programming. Yeah, original programming, all the pay-per-views every month. Shit. Matter of fact, when you pay the nine ninety nine, you get like the first paper. You get that month's pay per view for free, right? Whatever it be. You get every. You get all of them. Oh, you get the first month for free. Yep. Yeah. First month is free, motherfuckers. So if you sign up, you get the shit. This is also a fucking shout out to fucking M and M's, and Snickers, Mars Company, Nestle. Right? We fuck with all in on candy day today. Hell yeah. Halloween. Mm. Go I get you a Pepsi tonight. also. I cannot wait to eat candy tonight. Maybe stop at McDonald's and get one of them treat books. You know I thought about books? I thought about renting one of the fucking scooters, dude, and just like putting the kids on them and just zipping them up. <laughs> yeah, just zipping up to people's doors. Yep. That would be funny. Cutting through the yards. I bet you people have thought of that. I bet you we see kids zipping around tonight. It's raining, motherfuckers. It's so you about to take raining. out your kids? It's not. It stopped raining at four. We got uh, no rain for the night. It's gonna cool. be a fun trick or treating. Yeah, don't be a bitch because it's raining. You don't want to take your kids trick or treating. Get your ass out there and get wet. Don't be a don't be a pussy. That's your what kids she said. don't give a fuck. Your kids don't care, right? Right. So my kids are gonna be fucking Chucky and Tiffany. My three year old, as of today, twins, Axel and Alexis. Right, look, I've been planning this shit since they said you are pregnant and it's a boy and a girl. Damn. I swear to God. I'm like, oh shit, that's my Chuck and Tiffany moment. And they're gonna, cause I was like, I tried it before, remember? With fucking Austin and Abby. I did it, they were different sizes. It didn't work. Austin was, Austin was way too old himself. He was like four or five. It didn't work. I mean, it did work. No, hold on. Like, look, for y'all that fuck with us, check out my Facebook. Because I put them up, I'm gonna do it side by side. Because I did check in Tiffany, but it didn't work how I wanted it. Because Abby was like a foot taller than Austin. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It was just like a whole situation. Austin made a good Chucky, Abby made a good Tiffany, but I've been planning. Ever since I found out she was gonna have a boy and a girl, I've been planning like at a certain age, they're gonna be the perfect height. For Chucky and Tiffany. For Chucky and Tiffany. Well, apparently this is the year. Last year wasn't the year. She didn't want it to happen. Um, now it's time. <laughs> so, motherfuckers, stay tuned for that shit. I'm about to fucking... This shit's going to be insane. Motherfucker, well, make sure you look at all that shit. Um, fucking... What else happened? I went to a motherfucking wrestling show. AWR. Shout out to AWR and Circle City Wrestling. What the fuck was that show called? Holiday Hell? I'm pretty sure that's what it was called. The one I just went to the other day. I had the privilege, shout out to the homie fucking Stone, uh, for coming through and filming some matches. So uh, the return of What Up Ninja Wrestling or What Up Wrestling is definitely back. Like, we got some footage for y'all. A couple of matches, just three actually. Um, we didn't do commentary because I didn't have my commentary partner. And how can you have color without no fucking play by play or vice versa? You know what I'm saying? And it's hard as fuck to do both. Would you agree? Agree. Because he's back and forth trying to fucking. Yeah. I didn't have my commentary partner, but check it out. Near future, coming soon, we will be making our commentary return to fucking what a wrestling. So some more shit for y'all to watch. 
Stay tuned for that. I'm gonna get you. The title's on the line at some point. We don't even know. Motherfucker, stay tuned for that shit. Now, let's talk about what happened the other day. Let's talk about it. And, they, and <laughs> he's had his hands the whole time, dude. He's like, y'all slipping. Y'all supposed to do this. I, I just, I just don't know what. All right, to do I gotta take the hands. mask off for this one. I just don't know what to do with my hands. All right, so oh. you were a part of this too. Yes. We had planned because we can go ahead and tell y'all now because the videos are out. Uh, we had planned for quite a while uh, to with the homie Lexi at the Emerson Theater. If y'all don't know who the fuck that is, and fuck you, it don't matter. You don't matter. Nope, not even a little. <laughs> Lexi at the Emerson and us, we planned to do a ghost hunt. Which, being ninja is super fucking skeptical. I'm like the midway guy. It's not like, like I could go either way. I don't necessarily believe in ghosts because I've never seen one. But I'm not disbelieving. You know what I'm saying? Like you are. Like he's like, yeah, right, that shit's fake. I'm like on the edge. Like I'm on the line. Like I could go either way. I did hear some shit the other night. Anyway, we planned to ghost hunt the Emerson theater. Well, come time, we're all hype, right? Like, I was super hype about that shit for like a week. Like, oh shit. It's yeah, we talked about it all week. We missed Monday Night Raw, motherfuckers. That's how important this shit was. Like, both of us miss Monday Night Raw. We go to the Emerson Theater. Actually, Beat the Ninja beat me there by about 20 minutes. Uh, we get there. I chilled, dude. It was cool. I was talking about the Quickie Mart. Smoked some weed. It was good. Yeah, that's that's the, that's the typical Emerson thing. It just right, kind of yeah. brings it out of you. Yeah. Even if you're high already and you get there, yeah. you just kind of like have this sudden urge to just... Yeah, smoke some weed. Just sit and hang out. That's why you were like, I'm going to be a man. I'm like, all right, I ain't in no hurry. <sighs> Told so we get the there, net. and we find out that there's a band practicing at the Emerson. And they're going to be there for a good four or five hours. So... We're running up against the wall here because we planned the plan this whole time and we've been hyping it is for these What Up Ninja Ghost Hunt video to come out today as we record this today on Halloween, which it will be. Go watch it. It's out. Check it out. We plan on it to come out on Halloween. So we're running out of time. We're up against the wall. It's October 29th. It's fucking Devil's Night. Well, no, it's not. It's a Pre it's the, so it's night before, night Devil's, before night. Devil's Night. Night before Devil's Night. And we're like, fuck, now what do we do? Like, we need to go do something. Like, I was too hyped. You know, like when you have a show, and the show gets canceled at the last minute, and you just want to go do another show? Because, like, you was so like, fuck, man, what am I going to do now? Yeah, exactly. That's what we did. We were like, fuck it. Where can we go check out? So we looked up, like, haunted places. I guess they knew about it. I don't know. We end up in motherfucking Martinsville. Oof. Man. <laughs> Let's discuss. It made us that. all have anxiety. We rode through fucking Johnson County. You already know I was scared. All the way through Johnson County. <laughs> there was three different levels of anxiety going through that. I couldn't even smoke. In the car I was in, I couldn't even smoke weed. So like We was, smoked weed. We had lit the joint, got off the freeway, right? We get off 465. You see all the cops right there. Boom. It's like, oh, shit. So I fucking... I said it to him. We I literally, like, I out literally out. spit oh, on my fingers and put out the joint on my, on I my finger. Like, I, like, oh, I started fuck, freaking oh, out, too, bro. I was like, fuck. I got scared. And then as we're driving, we get a little bit more up the road. The fucking cop hits his lights, and they're pulling somebody over down the road. It's like, god damn, dude. We're seeing cops left and right. I'm like, I'm breathing. I'm taking deep breaths. Like, and then... Then, then the fun shit happened. No, no, no. So you didn't even have to go through the experience that we went through because... No, I did on the way home because I didn't think about that shit, that road. So we did it, and we ended up back at the motherfucker. Like, oh, shit, he brought us back. <laughs> <laughs> no, oh, God. I'm not going back. So we got, we passed the exit because it's like, you got to go to this road. So mm -hmm. we, we drive, and then, like, there's no road, there's no median, and it's telling us to, like, drive, drive, drive until we can get off on an exit and turn around. Mm -hmm. We flipped a U-turn in one of those like do not flip a U-turn areas. We totally flipped a U-turn in that bitch. And then we got off on, it was like, turn here, no road. Turn here, no road. Finally, we got off on the church exit or whatever it yeah, was. Yeah, I fucked that up on the way out. Then, by this time, my gas light's already on, dude, and it's been on. And we got to go, we're whipping, we still got like six miles. It's pitch black. Like, I'm talking like 
really out like of Like, you country. can see the cosmos. Yes, like, you can see everything. You can look at planets and shit. Like, it was dark. <laughs> it was fucking dark. And there was some windy motherfucking roads. Going up There was a turn that you had to, like, 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 it went like this. That one turn where it went, like, it went, like, around like this and shit. You had to, like, turn the whole shit and turn out yeah, to dude, it was, I'm telling you, it was insane. Crazy like, shit. She's freaking out because the fucking uh, gas light's on. She thinks we're going to run out of gas. It's all the main Nate's like Nate's, like, getting scared because she's getting scared. Yeah, I mean, I ain't going to lie. I can't, like, I'm not going to sit here and try to stick up for my damn self, but that is what I'm doing. I don't give a fuck. Lexi getting all scared and shit threw me into some type of, like, anxiety type thing. And all I knew was, was fuck that place. Fuck that place and everything because... Our phones were dying, the gas was running out, and we were fucked. Nah. Was, it, was it a similar, was you shook at all? Was it, was he there was low, see, he was low-key shook for a second, but then he snapped out of it. He was when like, was I'm too gangster for that. When was I shook? Bro, did he you was like, name, name any time I was shook. Did you feel the like moment you turned off the, all the lights up there and you was like, oh my God. It like, was that dark, was freaky. Dude. It was, it it was, was freaky. freaky. It was, was kind of scary. It's pitch black. We're in the middle of the woods, dude. So you can't say it didn't spook you? You can't, you can't say it didn't oh, really no, spook but I, you? I wasn't scared. I was just Well, like, we're not trying to say... Because, well, of course, I immediately locked the door because you're like, where the fuck, you know? Like, you don't know what the fuck's going to come out of the dark. But what if something had when y'all were you, were you that none were of you, us were prepared were y'all on edge enough to where like if some motherfucker had come running out the woods all y'all would have screamed like is that what would not swinging would have like yeah. y'all in, within the car like we all cut the lights east off side. y'all cut the lights off right um, y'all sitting there we ain't there yet we cut the lights on and we're not there yet the car. nah nah while the lights are off somebody runs up just ah, just walk in the fucking window and we're fucking going Oh god! Yeah, I would probably scream. <laughs> there would have been some urine. There would have definitely been some urine. <laughs> like, there would definitely would have. Start the fucking car. Let's get the fuck out of here. Nope. No. Nope, 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 nope. <laughs> oh shit! All right. So why? You do know we what have, I thought? Like why we were driving down. Why do we have middle nowhere in Martinsville? Because we went to Step, right? And it was Step called? Cemetery. Step Cemetery. Now, all right. This motherfucker. No, no matter what you believe. Don't believe in ghosts. This was one creepy ass location. Yes. Would you say that? Yes. Like it is a weird, crazy. You have to drive. Situation. You have to drive six miles in the woods. It's like the making of any movie. Roads. And then when you pull up, it's not even like a parking lot, or you like drive into the cemetery. You park at like the tip of it, right? That's yeah. Where we tip. We tip. Like we parked practically behind <laughs> the road, and we have to walk up this fucking dirt path that's surrounded by woods. Yep. That takes you into this like it just puts you in there. It's like a like, cove almost. It's almost like a court. Like something. if you were in a fucking a, like cul-de-sac, it would be like a fucking like one of those courts, right? Like yeah. you just but it, imagine you're in the middle of the woods and you're walking down a dirt road and it leads you to this court that's just fucking a bunch of graveyards. And this cemetery is like really a bunch of, old. Yeah, there's like people died in 1886 and 1863. <laughs> fucking crazy shit, dude. People have been dead for fucking over. But they still got flowers on 1827 or whatever. That's fucking weird. Um, so we're at Step Cemetery. Y'all might have heard about it. I, I've heard the name before, but I never thought that it would be. Okay, so we get there. We have the Ouija board with us. We got the Ouija board because we ain't no bitches. Uh, I don't believe it. Motherfuckers told us not to on the way there. I don't believe in it enough. It scared Nate like a motherfucker. He was like, I ain't doing that shit. And he didn't. No, I didn't because you know what? When you fuck with with Ouija boards in cemeteries, it's not a good mix. They keep trying to tell me that because I don't believe that it would happen, that it's not going to, like, I won't come in contact. I'm not open to it. I don't. So what did. That's what I'm How saying. Does that See, work? That's like, all right. Well, here's my opinion of that shit. I don't know nothing about all this shit. I'm like, <clears throat> I'm open to the idea of there being other shit, cause just like, okay, me and you disagree on the ghost thing, but at the same time, this motherfucker will tell you why there are aliens and argue with you a hundred million ways why there definitely are aliens. Yeah, but aliens. I don't believe that shit. Aliens in fucking uh, what? like I don't inter- believe in no fucking aliens. In energies that just like have life and because where does your energy go when you die, dude? It's our, our like our brains make us think, right? Like it's no, our but brains. You that, have, like, you're, you're, so you say you don't have a soul, a soul or a spirit like that doesn't exist. 
There's nothing in you that makes you different than any other motherfucker. Just your conscience well, and just, the way you think and the different like receptacles that go off in your brain that make you like blue cheese or ranch or yeah, you see, like that's what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah, we go through, basketball. We go through different If that was the case, if there'd be like every few people there'd be Everybody has their own you. everybody has their own individuality, dude. But like that's just your conscience. That's like I don't know what that is. I don't know It's your spirit, it's your soul. I guess. It makes you you. I believe that your like energy, like when you're buried, goes up through like the soil and the grass, and then insects eat on the grass, and animals eat on the insects. I think we then... just turn in. I think we just turn <laughs> into like compost, and eventually just become part of the earth. Well, that's eventually. I don't know. You ever, you ever had deja vu? Yeah. They say that's what deja vu is. Is you remembering like it's like oh I did this before. You didn't necessarily do it in this life. But like you so, may have done it in another life. What I think to myself is, what the fuck? So, like, why am I, like, living the same life over and over again? You're not. You might be... But I'm doing uh, completely shit. Completely different. Doing s- the but same you did shit. some... Yeah, there's some, some shit that you do. Living the same life over and over? No, not necessarily. Otherwise, you'd always have deja vu. Yeah, that's true. You know what I mean? But, like, I don't know. Like, maybe, maybe you hang out here until your next life is ready. Because like people were like, oh, you lived in the 1800s <coughs> was one of your lives, right? Well, you didn't go from 1800s and just automatically come back. You didn't come back till 19 something. Maybe you're a ghost and you hang out here until your next life. It's time for your next life, and then you fucking be something else hmm. or somebody else. I mean, I get the concept. I just, I personally just, I don't think it works like that, man. Like honestly, I don't have an answer for why. So we're out there, we and are, let me tell you fans. this. I did not see the thing move. I don't. I don't necessarily. They might be moving it. They might not be moving it. That's why I've never. That shit. Well, that's why I've never done the Ouija board thing because I always think that somebody, whoever asks you to do it, is going to be the well. See, that's the point though. I'm the one that asked for the Ouija board, and I wasn't going to move that shit. You know what I'm saying? But usually it's whoever asks for the Ouija board is the one that moves it. All I'm saying is every time my hand was on it, that <laughs> motherfucker didn't move. And the minute that I moved my hand, it was just zip, 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 whipping all over the place. It moved like, last night. Yeah, we didn't talk about last night yet, but it moved last night with your hand on it. It did move last night with my hand on it. It did, but... And I, my point and I, I made on that was like, if they were, if they didn't move it, the I girls think didn't move lying. it. That's until, a, I'm calling it. I think someone's lying. It would have to be both of them, though. That's the point. Because if the girls didn't move it while you were touching it, then you would have physically had to have been stopping them from moving it. Otherwise, they could have moved it with you touching it. You know what I'm saying? It was moving while I was touching it. I know, but that's what I'm saying. It wasn't moving as much as it was when you wasn't touching it. Because I had my hand on it, like, and it when it would resist, like, I would feel it tugging, and then I would start to go with it. But you don't know it's tugging until like it's tugging. You know what I mean? Other All right. So basically. Did we come in contact with ghosts? Fuck no. We're not gonna man no bullshit. He can't say that because we don't know yet. We we can't tell you that, otherwise they wouldn't watch. Shut up. <laughs> we did. We talked to Elvis and all kinds of motherfuckers. <laughs> like he all he said was, uh uh-huh. This like, should be out by then. Yeah, but no, check it out. We may or may not have contacted whatever. Some shit did happen, whether or not I had believed fun. it or didn't believe it. Put in the comments what you thought. This may or may not be a new show. Uh, it's I had we, fun. It's where we go. I had awesome fun with it. Yeah, I had a lot of fun. Me and AJ would sat around and play different scenarios of the police running. <laughs> yes, up. that was what I was getting at. We pull up, and as creepy as it's been that our trip has been through fucking creepy abandoned trailers and shit and farmhouses and the woods, we get there and there's a sign, and I want to say it was like eleven fifteen or something probably when yeah. we got there. And there's a sign that says property closed at property 11. closed at 11 and we're in a state forest where i know there are park rangers and park rangers fuck with you like so and i've already been told by the paranormal b-town paranormal shout out to them uh that if shit closes at 11 don't get caught by the fucking game warden or blah blah blah, blah right so we get there and i see this sign and that sets in a whole new set of fear Right. Well, I guess fear on top of even if I was a little bit creeped out by the surroundings, now I'm scared. I have weed on me. <laughs> I rolled a joint. We're in the John. We're not even in Johnson County anymore. We're in a county I don't even know anything about. We're in about. KKK Central. Yes. <laughs> and we are not ba- like 
we're not necessarily, we're not friendly with them motherfuckers. They, I don't know how KKK feel about a motherfucking white dude with braids. They probably don't feel good about it. Or a bald dude. Yep, or a or bald motherfucker with, like, fuck them. I don't fuck with them, so they probably ain't gonna fuck with us. The bald dude with no hair. And they could be out doing fucking crazy shit. So we're scared of that shit. There's police sounds. We get in this motherfucker, and I swear I hear a car door. Y'all heard something too, right? We all heard the, the same direction. The same it way. sounded like a car door, which instantly tells me, oh shit, the police are at the car. Right. So I, we, myself and being a ninja, automatically. Immediately. You know, like, as soon as we heard the car door, we went for our shit. Where's my shit at? Where's my I might weed? need to stash this real quick. Right. Like, I was like it's going to take them a second to get up here. We're going to see the lights coming. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, oh, when I got there, I wasn't going to have no drugs on me at all. Put it like that. Um. Or if I did, it would be fucking stashed properly. Right, that was some, that was some ghosts. <laughs> that was, uh... So that happened, if y'all was doing a Ouija board, and a fucked up mutant fucking squirrel started making weird ass fucking crazy sounds. All kinds of shit started happening in the woods. The wolves, the dogs, or wolves, or whatever the fuck was howling, forever, like, it sounded like the police sirens way off in the distance, but it wasn't, it was, it was a dog. Like those videos are fucking funny. Make sure y'all check that shit out. Uh, if y'all fucked with it, then we might do some more shit. Like, cause I had fun with it. Now, Tuesday we did, we fucking did make it to the Emerson Theater. Uh, so there was actually two episodes of What a Ninja Ghost Hunters fucking shot this week. So make sure you stay tuned for both of those. Fucking right, not stay tuned. They'll be, they're already out. I'm thinking we live. I'm high. Fuck it. What can you do? They're already out. Well, they're out. Don't stay tuned. Watch that shit. <laughs> stay tuned for any future episodes. If y'all like that shit, comment on that shit. If y'all see anything in that shit, point that shit out to us. You know what I'm saying? We don't know what we're doing. Like, straight up. Whether we believe or don't believe, we, we're not Ghostbusters. We don't know how to ghost hunt. We ain't never had thought I was just about go, I just went for something to do. I like those shows, the Ghost Hunter shows. They cool. I never we didn't thought, do none of the shit they did. I never thought at one point in time we were ever going to find a ghost. All right, so did we find a ghost? Y'all be the judge of that shit. Let us know. Did we or didn't we? Did we? Man, hell no, nah, but we probably caught some really decent ass fucking orbs from You know what orbs pictures. are, right? The orbs, that's. They're like energy, they're like balls of energy, which is completely well, different from ghosts. ghosts. Well, ghosts, ghosts is like are a full fucking. Ghost is like the full, full soul body. itself. It's supposed to be like the, your soul is like. It's an entity. Pretty it's much. Full. And your, and your energy and your soul are two, two completely different enti- in like entities. You know what I mean? So we, we, we did, you did take some pictures and cross some pictures and, and some we shit. found like And I seen a, a few crazy things in some of the pictures that Abby took last night, which I haven't showed you yet, which I got the camera. So after we're done here, I'll show you. There's some like discrepancies. Some things. Some discrepancies. Um, but make sure y'all watch them motherfuckers. If y'all fuck with it, we'll keep doing it. I had fun with it. I did Emerson too. Theater, Step Cemetery, episode one and two, out now. What Up Ninja Podcast, episode 9, out right now. This is obviously number 10. 11 will be coming at you next week. About to go fucking trick-or-treating. Be safe. I gotta go get some candy. Candy, motherfuckers. We're gonna go take all your candy. So if I took your candy, if you're watching this, and you know right now that we took your fucking candy, get over if it. If you brought your kid to my house, believe that I took some candy in, it, in exchange. Was it true? Yes. I'll give him some nasty shit and take a Reese's. Go watch Halloween, the number one motherfucking movie in the country. If you ain't seen that shit yet, you fucking up. Two weeks in a row. That's what I'm saying. It's killing the whole box office. There ain't never been a Halloween release so big out of all the Halloweens and shit. Like, go watch that shit. It's dope. I've already seen that bitch twice. Go watch it. Go watch that motherfucking. Also, check out motherfucking... Wait. They were already seen it. If you didn't see Crown Jewel... <laughs> Go see it. Go watch that shit. <laughs> Go see it. Have, it will have happened between now and then. Go watch Women's Evolution, WWE Evolution. I don't even know. I'm ready to go get this fucking holiday started. Catch us on the fucking streets tonight. You never know what we're going to be wearing. My brother brought you with a ski mask and asked for your wallet. And then we'll be like, nah, we'll just play. Ring your doorbell and just, uh, when you open the door, just force my way in. How do you like that? 
That's hey, how being a ninja rules. That feels kind of invasive. And fuck, I have no idea kind how of this podcast is, <laughs> but I really don't give a fuck because we got shit to do. So that's 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 where we're gonna wrap this shit up. Motherfucker, you feeling that? I feel that. All right, fuck it. We gave you two and a half hours on episode nine. Watch that shit. We gave you something on Trust this too, me. probably a long ass time. Gold, two and a half hours. If this bitch is only an hour and a half, fuck it. I don't know how long That's all kinds of shit. That. We've been here for a while. My ass hurts. Yeah, my ass is on, on, on going to sleep mode. And my brain is. <laughs> so we're getting the fuck out of here. We're going to go celebrate the holiday. I'm B the Ninja. I'm Naptown Ninja AJ. I'm Nate the Ninja. Nate the Tripod was here, but we had to remove him from the building because these motherfuckers, man. Maybe we'll have that match. Fucking, we'll, we'll make up a new title and we'll fucking we'll have that match. The, the cameraman future. title? The motherfucking Nate the Ninja versus fucking Tripod Nate. Tri- tripod Nate, man. Extra lightweight. That could be some, that could be some shit. shit. And that's what's up, Ninjas. Whoa, whoa, Until whoa, next whoa. time.